A very good morning, Om Shanti to all of you listeners. Welcome back to your own channel. Seek the soul that totalizes within. Those of you who are listening on to WhatsApp, you can also visit the channel Seek the Soul that Totalizes Within on YouTube itself. And today is 10th of May. We're going to do a recording of today's blessing where Baba says, "Just have a relation with me, so I and my Baba. Baba means Father. Father means the Creator." So Baba wants to uh, us to have a relation with Him so that we feel liberated from all the troubles, all the tribulations, all the whys and why nots in our life. Let's see what does He have to say. Baba says, "May you experience the stage of liberation. That means living in this body, one can feel liberated from all the pain and suffering and sadness in our life." So God says, "May you experience the stage of liberation in life with the method of I and my Baba." and become an easy yogi that means we are taking love peace happiness credibility and everything else from only supreme god father and we have stopped asking for respect for love for understanding from human beings that is what it means to be i and my baba and nobody else to become a brahmin means to be liberated from any bondages of your body that means if i am taking the happiness or if i am taking the the taste of any of the five senses from my body that means i am still disconnected from the supreme father's love and happiness i am taking it still from the body i means the soul you means the soul any bondages of your body and bodily relationships and facilities so either we are taking happiness and contentment because of our body from our body from the five senses from bodily relationships we expecting love and happiness and respect from other people and uh, uh, understanding from them acceptance from them or from facilities around us that means when we have facilities around us we are feeling contented we are feeling like whole and complete when they are not around us we are completely sad and scattered and shattered so god says so that you don't go through all that kind of feelings you be in the relationship with me and take everything only from me because you are a soul immortal imperishable non physical entity who is trying to take everything from this world but you need to take it from the supreme being who is also immortal and imperishable when god says the relationships of your body do not have a connection with your body the relationships of my body does not have a connection with my body but with the soul so i my family members i don't have a connection with the body but i have a connection with the soul so i have to start looking at the soul so looking at the soul's mind intellect and their habits and recognize them through this and not through the physical body so when god says if someone in, is influenced by another that is a bondage that say if i am a fan if i am a fan of somebody and that person has got certain qualities and if i'm getting influenced by that person getting attracted to that person that is also a bondage however to be a brahman means that means to be somebody who's following adam who was connected and next to god somebody who's following adam who was so closest to god and if you want to be the closest to god and receive peace and happiness from him then any kind of attraction to any human being has to cease now itself However to be a brahman means to be liberated in life that means i'm liberated from any bondages from any attractions from people and any attractions or expectations from people or bodily beings even from this body even from the things around me in my house i'm not expecting anything from them too i'm i'm becoming so pure and so powerful god says for as long as you have the support of your physical organs the body you have to perform actions so that is for sure i the soul have to perform my karma with the help of this body but do not have karmic bondages of karma but relationships of karma that means i am performing my karmas but at the same time i am getting attached to my karma i did it my idea was like that i have done this i am so and so i am a i am a poet or i am a writer or i am a singer or i am so and so god says don't be attached to that bondage also because that will sound like ego and ego means loneliness so loneliness means no connection with god and no connection with people too 
so god then says those who are liberated in this way are constant embodiments of success in life the easy method to use for this is i and my baba that means i and my baba are what are connected and i am doing my karma by being in connection with god i am not expecting anything from this world from worldly beings from human beings no praise no no affirmations from them that i am good or i am better i am not expecting anything from them because if i expect it from them then i'll be saddened when they don't give it to me so i only expect it from god father this remembrance makes you an easy yogi that means i can easily meditate then otherwise people will be remembered things will be remembered if i am attached to them if i am taking happiness and contentment from them then god won't be remembered and i'll get into bondage of those things and then sadness loneliness comes in or seeps in slowly an image of success and free from any bondages so how do you do that for more details you can come and visit the brahma kumari center and understand more in details with this om shanti